Hey everyone, so today we're gonna make um, a cake made with a yogurt pot. You, you're gonna understand it. So basically it's a very soft spongy cake and I'm gonna put some apple. And you can put anything, any fruit you want, uh, flavor it with anything. It's a really good cake based, which you can play with it so much. I had to call my mom. <laughs> to ask the right recipe because I couldn't remember exactly but it's super easy to remember now you know ok so let's peel the apple yeah? right so once the apple are peeled we're just gonna cut them up ok so my pan is warming up some dice not, not too chunky okay so now we're gonna caramelize the apple my mother just told me that she put all those little apples in a bowl put a bit of dark rum and let it um, matured into the rum and then you put the whole mix into the cake it's delicious how uh, you can um, use apricot, pears whatever you fancy already so the pan is hot I'm gonna put a little bit of sugar to start the caramel well actually the pan was not that hot <laughs> see, it starts to melt you see and it's gonna turn into caramel ok so you see I have, I have to change the pan because the other pan was really uh, crap so um, I've changed the pan and you see the sugar all melted and it turned into a beautiful caramel uh, when you come to this stage, be careful because it can take the dark color too quickly and it becomes bitter then. So at this stage, I'm gonna put some butter to deglaze the butter a bit. And I'm gonna put the apple. We're gonna let the apples warm up in the caramel. So then we can glaze them all, yeah? But they have to be, become warm. Because now they are cold, so they, they have set all the caramel into the pan. So it has to melt again and warm up again. It's a nice warm. We're gonna toss them. The juice of the apple has melted into the sugar, into the caramel. Okay, so we we'll really have to let it reduce now. So let's finish cooking it. Don't be long. So while it is cooking, uh, we're gonna start our mix here. Yeah? So we need one yogurt, one pot of yogurt, any kind of size. But if you have a massive pot of yogurt, you're gonna end up with a massive cake. So this is um, 150 grams. It's just an individual yogurt, basically. But we tip over into a bowl. Plain yogurt here. This one is amazing. Best yogurt I've ever tried. Made with organic milk in the UK. It's just next door to us actually. So clean it, dry it, and we're gonna use it as a cup, as a measuring cup. Who is bubbling there? 
Put your way this way. Okay, if this is dry, clean, we're gonna put the sugar. So my mother said, Oh, you're young, you can put two cups of sugar. <laughs> if you're old, you can put one and a half. <laughs> so, well, totally full cups, yeah? Two. You want to mix that, no? I mix it well, gently, yeah? This is Nolan? No. Mix it very well. It's more like yogurt. Yeah, it's made with a yogurt. And that's gonna make a cake super tender. Okay, now we're gonna put eggs. Mm -hmm. Okay? Did you want to check? No, it should be fine. So, one egg, mix it through. Do you know why we crack the eggs in the pot? Here? Yeah? So the shells doesn't fall into your uh, mix. Is it mixed through? No. Go on! One more. And the third one, uh, mix it well, and then we're gonna put the flower. It's weird. It's weird color. Yeah, it's a weird color, like a pale yellow. It's like skin. Okay. Done. Let me check. Okay, put one pot of uh, flour. All of it? Yeah, yeah, all of it. Yeah. And wait, wait. And we're gonna put teaspoon. Daddy, I'll put some juice on it. That's okay. Level teaspoon of baking powder. We're gonna put two. Now you can start mixing. <coughs> Gently mm. because it's flour. It's white color. And one more. Mm. And a third one. I think we need some more water in here. No, it should be fine. Do you want me to give you a go? No. Okay, maybe you can now. Like that. Scrape the sides. Give an energy mix. Energy mix. And what do you think it will taste like? Delicious. Yeah, can I smell? Yeah, you can test it with your finger. Mm. You want to test? But it still smells like yogurt. Yeah, it does. And the last pot of flour. This is hard to do that for. <clears throat> I look careful, it's hot. But look, the apples, they're gonna go inside the cake. It's mm. gonna caramelize, it's beautiful. Daddy, you mm. know how we make caramelized popcorn? We get like caramelized, put it under a bowl, and then mix caramelized popcorn. I know. Yeah. <laughs> you want me to finish it? It becomes, it becomes quite thick and hard, yeah? Yeah. So now this is gonna be to cook our um, cake. So you can spread all the butter all around the mold, yeah? And on the sides as well. Okay, the cake mix is done. So we get ready our cake mold. This is ready. Get ready the cake mold. It's not ready. It's very slippery. Yeah. And then we will mix our apple. Okay, so see the apples? There's no more juice, no more lumps of caramel. It's totally caramelized glazy. It's beautiful. So we're gonna take them off.
let it cool down before to add it into our cake mix. So well done, Nono. So now we're just gonna smooth all that grease inside the cake mold. Smooth it like that, so it's everywhere. And then, I'll put some flour. Spread it? Uh, no, you have to shake the mold. You can't put your finger anymore. On the sides. On the sides. And then remove the excess. Oh, it's very messy. That's it. See, I gave you a big bang above the sink. Mm, that looks amazing. Yeah. So the cake will never stick. And you know what we forgot? No. We forgot some oil. So some vegetable oil. A three quarter of the pot. All of it? All of it inside here. The cake mix. Mm. You want me to mix it? Daddy? Yeah, please. And again, you can put some uh, vanilla essence, anything you're fancy. Really? This looks like mustard. Ah, yeah, or mayonnaise. <coughs> yeah, it looks more like mustard, though. Should we put the apples on the same time? Yeah. Oh, it's hot. Yeah. Da. There we go. Wow, that's gonna be amazing. Can I push them in? Yeah. Wow. It's shiny, huh? You can hear the sound. Mm. This looks like an icing cake. Hello, Muffy. Okay, so you can pour it in now. Right in the middle, yeah? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna help you to scrape it out. Hold the bowl. Mm. Did you try it with your finger? No. You should. No. Why? <laughs> Look. I it down. Look, there's more. You remember, I'm gonna spread it. Yeah. There you go. Spread it. Put it level, yeah? Take a bit some of here and push it down there. There, that's it, that's it. Then it's gonna level up into the oven anyway. That's it? Should we bake it now? Yeah. Allez. Yeah. Up. So the oven, 170 degrees until it's cooked. So basically it's gonna become a nice colory golden color on Are top. Are gonna be bubbles? Yeah. And when you want to know when it's cooked, what do you have to do? Put to a, Oh, put a bell on it. No. <laughs> and to, to check the cake. Oh yeah, you get a knife and if it's easy to push it in, let me just cut. Okay, cool. So we will do that, yeah? Careful girl. Okay, in the oven. You want to put the bell? Uh -huh. Hey. How long? Uh, Ten minutes? To start with? Okay. One. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, cool. So that's all. We will see the result in a bit. <coughs> The flour and the butter you've put, yeah, it's gonna to avoid sticking. So. But daddy, do you want to try? Yeah, hold well on, try it just to make sure it's not gonna stick. So we could let it cool down into the bowl. Hey, I see an apple, yeah, that's gonna be delicious. It smells amazing. Wait, there is no careful your nose. <laughs> so we're gonna turn it on, okay. Do you know how we do? Yeah. 
Where does the hood? Yeah, we need the cloth to turn it over. Okay, like that. You fold it. You fold it down. Da -da. Okay, and now we're gonna put it. I see apple juice. Under watch. Hey, voila! Nice! That looks yummy. Yeah! So, yeah, give you a go during the, during the lockdown. It's great to do it. And, uh, yeah, we wish you all the luck. Bye bye!